Mother, what are you doing here? You used to call me Tama. I also used to wet the bed. Want me to start that up again? I'd rather you didn't. Not that it's my business. She's not in my... She always did like the flustered ones. In truth, Evitash's tastes are quite varied. Although it is uncommon for her to be attracted to men. Mother. Perhaps because in some ways, she acts more like a man herself. <sighs> huh. I had big fingers. Used to take me forever. Sorry. She's like that. So it's uncommon for you to be interested in men, but not unheard of? Huh. Well, thanks for coming. We should get back. Thanks for having me along. Maybe we can do this again. Right? Yep. Are you trying to have sex with me? Oh, wow. I, in my daydreams, this is where you lean over me and slap the wall. Quick, think about us having sex. So now we need to figure out if it's cash lock or tom lock. And those are... Cash lock's just flirting. You look and make jokes and maybe think about him for fun. Tom lock is serious. Like you want to grab that and taste its neck right by the collarbone. <laughs> so which is it? So which one was serious? There was something about tasting the neck. Tom Locke. That's maybe where I'm at. Good. Me too. Your mother said it was uncommon for you to be interested in men. I'm glad you're making an exception. The bar's a little higher. You're good. What happens now? Usually I'd pin you to the wall, but... We work together. It's weird. And fancy mage clothes. Because I like them? You're barely even wearing a shirt. You fight Anton with a bare midriff. Everything all right? We're fine. Just trading fashion tips. So what I wear is a problem for you? It's not. It's just... Why dress like that? Are you trying to make your mother happy? Tosh, what's going on? Something is clearly bothering you. My bets on mothers and dresses. It's just something my mother said the other day. That I act more like a man than a woman. And you feel like you should wear dresses to make her happy? <laughs> no. Can you imagine me in a dress? I'd look stupider than I... I'd look stupid. This isn't about the dress, is it? No, it's... I don't know. She always says stuff like that. About how I dress, how I act. And? It feels... right. When she says I act more like a man. It feels... right. Why does it feel right? Tosh, do you like being a woman? <laughs> Nobody likes being a woman. Ah. This is stupid. Forget I said anything. If you don't want to talk about it anymore, we won't. But whatever this is, this team is here for you. I, I still don't know what this is. Some of my friends in Minrathas talk about not feeling comfortable in their own skin. As a man, as a woman. I could see if they'd like to talk. Maybe what they say fits how you're feeling. Yeah. Okay. And thanks. You do look really pretty. Oh? To look at, I'd smudge your makeup. I'm a dragon slayer. Tosh. I'm a crappy Kunari. I'm not really Ravani. I'm no good as a daughter. 
I'm not even... I can't even be a woman, right? I have to be a dragon slayer. I'm a dragon slayer. I'm a dragon slayer! So, I'm non-binary. Why did she do that? Is it because I didn't fit as a woman? Is it why I don't fit as a woman? Tosh. The Shadow Dragons say there are people who use they instead of he or she. They're not men or women. And I like how it feels when I imagine myself that way. But... I'm not supposed to breathe fire. Am I not supposed to feel like this? What does she want me to be? What do you want to be? Your mother brought you to her vein for a better life. I know. So live it. Be who you are. Don't tie yourself down for someone else's fear. I want to be... No. I am Ravani. And I'm not the daughter my mother wanted. That Tosh... She was never really me. Who is the real Tosh? She is... They are... Not a woman. Or a man. The Shadow Dragons had some fancy terms, but using they and knowing that, it feels good. Sounds like a good start. Okay. Bye. Oh. Thanks for coming. She used she. You haven't told her yet. I was going to. Then we got here and she was like that. You should be able to be yourself around her. Huh. Hey, you get to be who you are. I know. I know. <sighs> I'll tell her. When you're ready. On your terms. Thanks. Trophy from the Fang Scorcher? She was a good fight. You gonna whine and complain every time we hunt a dragon? I'd love to tell you no, but realistically, <laughs> at least I'm being honest. When you were standing over the dragon, you said something. Chakra Toeb. It's the same thing your mother told you. You must struggle with what you are. It's what she told me when I was a kid. Still does. So I don't let the dragon out. Meaning your fire breath? It's not just about the fire. It's about how stuff makes me feel. What I do when I'm angry. I've seen you angry. You're fine. No, I'm not. I get... I can get... this... rage. Where I just have to break something, and I can get stuck in arguments, needing things to be a certain way. The Antom would have turned me into a berserker. Breathing fire across the battlefield, killing anything in my way. I don't want to be that. Sidombi? Just like that? Yeah, just like that. You are Ravani. You have the freedom to let yourself feel things instead of locking them down. I mean, we just killed a dragon thanks to you. How hard can anything else be after that? Yeah, I guess you're right. I think I'm ready to talk to my mother about who I really am. Still a stupid name. Dragon King. Dragons wouldn't have kings. They'd have queens, 